What's going on guys? Happy Friday. It's another edition of the Infinity Videos coming to you live from Heart Infinity by Anthony and Dean. I'm your host Anthony and Dean. Welcome. Today's demonstration, we're going to be going over the center console of a 2013 Infinity JX35 all-wheel drive model. Going over the buttons aspect, pointing out what each, each one of them does. Kind of going into detail about each one of those. Ranging from the radio to the navigational system to the dual climate control and everything in between. So what I need you to do is I need you to subscribe down below, like the video, leave some comments, let me know what you want to learn about any Infinity, any model, and it'll get done for you. Enjoy. So here we are on the inside of the 2013 Infinity JX35. Today's demonstration, we're going to be going over the buttons for the center console located right here. From the radio portion, from the navigational portion, information, settings, to the heat and air conditioning, to the up top of the screen aspect. We'll kicked off with the radio section of the JX35 center console. This silver portion located right here. You're going to have Seek, Category, and Track, FM, AM, XM, Disk and Aux, Random Repeat, Scan. The number is 1 through 6. You have your CD, Insert, plus the Eject button, Volume Control on the left, Tune button on the right. I'm going to back it up a little bit just so you can see the screen aspect itself. As you can see up top, right now we are listening to XM. Artist is Chris Lake, Title Sundown. Channels BPM, Dance Electric is the category, and it's channel 51 on the XM. Down below, as you see, is our dual climate control. We're going to dive into that a little bit after. Stepping back, down below. So now, stepping back, I'm just going to demonstrate each of the buttons. I'm not going to make it too uh, too long or in-depth and torture you guys. First, what we're going to do is the AM, FM button right here. I want you to do is I want you to watch the screen right there, as well as watch this section of the screen up top as well every time I hit it. You hit the FM button, as you can see, it will kick over to FM. You kick over to AM. The button right to the right is the XM button. Again, if you hit the XM button, it will literally just kick it back over to the XM. As you notice, I'll tell you what, what channel or station you're listening to here. When you're listening to XM, I'll tell you the artist and title. And then up top, I'll tell you the category as well as the station itself. Down below, if you hit the disc and aux button, it will suck you from CD to the aux port. Right now there is no CD in there. If you hit the button again. As you can see there's no Bluetooth audio connected. Right now it's trying to connect to our iPhone system located here with the music that can be played from your playlist as well as Pandora, any of the apps. If you go ahead and click it again, the aux like port itself is located inside the center console right here. Simply click up, flip back, and as you're going to see located, let me get you right in there, on the left hand side, you're going to have your red, white, and yellow adapter ports like the back of your television. You also have a USB port located here. You have a car charger or car adapter port located there as well. That's inside the center console. Anything plugged into this port right here will be, or the USB as well, will pop up under the aux port. In the aux section right here, as you can see, status is aux. All right, so getting back into it, RDM and RPT, located on the right-hand side, stands for random and repeat. So if you're listening to a CD, or you're listening to your iPhone, your iPod, just random or repeat the song or playlist. Scan is going to be used when you listen, for example, if you're on FM, and you look up top, as you can see, we're on 89.7 now, and you hit the scan button, it will literally just scan it to the next station that's available. And so I felt what I felt in his demeanor is that he's trying. Volume control is located on the left hand side, turn dial. You simply just turn it up, turn it down, nice and simple with that. On the left hand side, right here is going to be your bass, tune, treble, balance, and fade button. So, for example, we're going to tune the volume up just a little bit. And you look down, if you press the tune button, now watch the screen. You can adjust the bass with the tune button. You can adjust the treble, the balance, and the fade. All you're doing is just simply pressing that button in until you get to the appropriate option that you are looking for. Very nice and easy CD player, just simply input, eject button there. The last button right here is the seek category and track. When you're listening to XM, it will cycle you to the different categories, so country, Christian, jazz and watercolors, 
classical, family and health, and you get the picture of pop, rock, old school. If you're listening to an iPhone or an iPod or a CD, it'll just cycle you to the next track. Track one, track two, track three, track four, and so on and so forth. Last things are the six buttons located down below here. Those are your preset buttons for your AM, FM, XM stations. So for example, if you're listening to channel 51, which is my personal favorite on XM, and you want to save that as one of your presets, you want to do is click and hold the one button or the two, whichever preset you wanted. So we're going to use the one. Now watch the screen and watch right to the left of XM51. As you can see, preset showed. You want to hold the one button or the two, whichever number you are, until you see that. Now that button is set for a preset. So if you're listening to preset four, which happens to be channel 47, and you want to listen to preset one, channel 51, just hit it again, and then boom, so that you're off. includes the radio aspect of the center console for the JX35. Next we're going to concentrate on is the heat, air conditioning, and dual climate control system. Follow that up with the last remaining navigational information and settings unit. So stay tuned. Flip to the next. Flip to the next video. Watch it, like it, subscribe to it, and you're gonna learn a lot about the infinity.